So I'm working with our marketing team at the moment to build a white paper focused on generative AI and Microsoft Copilot. And coincidentally, today we've had Copilot turned on within our Microsoft 365 tenancy. I thought I'd have a little bit of a look to see how we can use Copilot to accelerate the finalization of the white paper and turn it into something we can publish uh, online. So I've got about 15 pages worth of content here. It's uh, close to five and a half, uh, five and a half thousand words. Um, there's a few holes in it at the moment we wanna kind of fill out and I'll show you how we can do that in a second. But the first thing I wanted to focus on is just trying to get a better title for this white paper. You can see here that we've got generative AI and Microsoft Copilot, how to prepare your organization and your IT environment to outpace 2024. It's, it's a pretty okay, headline but it's not really going to get, grab anyone's attention so i want to use copilot to help us craft a better title uh, for the white paper so what i'm going to do i'm in word here at the moment i'm just going to click on the copilot uh, button on the side bring in the copilot tab and then what i'm going to do is uh can you suggest i did own titles for this white paper that will encourage people to read it what copilot's doing at the moment is obviously looking at the content of the document based on what we've written uh, and hopefully pulling together a great list of um, potential titles we could use here. And there we go, we've got five different titles we can use there, pretty good ones there. Uh, they're probably better structured and better written than what I've got there. So um, we might just take this last one here because I think I like that, revolutionizing the way we work, Microsoft Copilot and Generative AI. I'm gonna copy that and let's replace it here. Uh, so now we've got a great headline for our white paper, a new title for, for the white paper. What I want to do is create a subtitle that draws on some of the statistics that we have within the document itself. So I'm just going to ask Copilot five seconds, ten seconds to kind of work through it. And it's looking through the, you know, the content that we have in the, the document itself. You know, it's five and a half, six thousand words. This is what I'm really liking about Copilot so far is it, it's really like that, um, that intern that you can rely on to do some of the research for you to Kind of tie this stuff together, it gets you to a point where you're going to do the refinement at the end. As you can see here, we've got five options for the subtitle. I think that last one there, because it's got three different stats in it, I might use that one. Uh, I might just use the second part of that. Again, we don't have to use everything that Copilot gives us, we just use the best bits, right? I'm going to drop that in there. So what I want to explore is putting a new paragraph into this bit of the copy here. So I think there's a, this is something missing here that, that in terms of telling the story, I can't quite put my finger on it. Uh, I kind of know where to start, but I just need to kind of get some thoughts together. So what I'm going to do is click on the little draft with Copilot button here on the left hand side. It's going to pop up this little window here and it says, what do you want to, what do you want to write about? I'm going to say, um, I need to write a paragraph that talks to the intelligence Copilot can provide. Let's see what it comes up with. And what I found when I've been working with Copilot is that, again, it, it produces great content to start with, but it still requires uh, a human touch to try and refine it, to get it into the, the way that you want it to be written, right? So here we go, it actually looks pretty good, I think. So what I might do is just do a, a I might keep that, but I'm gonna do a bit of a re-edit to it, obviously, because I wanna make sure that it fits in with what we're talking about here. I might get rid of that first sentence there, and then into that paragraph. Copilot can help you find information, it's great. Copilot can learn from your feedback and preferences and adapt to just you know, learn from power. Yeah, that's pretty good. I think I'll keep that there. So again, very quickly, just so I was able to get a bulk of a paragraph in, uh, able to fill a gap, do a quick little human edit on top of it to kind of make it work there, which is good. One final thing I'd love uh, Copilot to help me with is to build some copy for our landing page of where we're going to download the white paper. I'm going to give a summary of exactly what people can expect when they download the white paper as well. Um, for ease, I'm just going to put it into this document just here before the executive summary. So what I might do is just add a page break to start with. So we've got the page break there. And then I'm going to just use that, use the draft with uh, Copilot button there. Let's see what it comes up with. So at the moment, Copilot's looking at the content of the document. And now it's trying to write some persuasive text uh, for our website that kind of summarizes what you'll get out of the white paper and uh, encourage you to download it as well. So my first impressions of Microsoft Copilot within uh, Word is nothing short of spectacular. The ability to help us craft content quickly, you know, be that intern that helps us kind of get that first draft done, the first 60% done, and we can come in as uh, supervisors to come in and help refine that content and make it work for us was really great. I was able to summarize content really well, that landing page copy we did at the end there definitely helped accelerate our workflow to get uh, not just from the document we we're creating, but also how we distribute it really tightly done as well. If you love what you saw here and you want to learn more about how you can apply within your organization, make sure you check out more of the content from Rapid Circle. Uh, follow us on LinkedIn uh, to learn more or talk to one of our team. We'll be able to help you guide you through your co-pilot journey as well. Talk soon.